Yo, what is going on guys? This is your boy, Oreo, and today we are going to be doing a tutorial on Sony Vegas and we'll be showing you how I actually start my edits so then you can learn how to start edits or something. What we will be doing in this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to sync clips, uh, trick shots and um, feeds. I'll not be showing you how to mark thing beats because that's pretty obvious because all you do, you find your beat which is one here and then you just click M. <laughs> That's all it is. But I have them all marked out on this anyway, so let's start on this. This is the clip. That's the clip, that's the song. We got a cheeky bit of Shakira. <laughs> you know, it's got some good beats, that's why I'm using it. It's easier. So what you want to do, click on the clip. First thing what you always have to do with clips is go on switches and then disable resample or else it'll ghost and it'll look bad and if you have 60 fps clips that's what you want you don't want 30 fps or else it'll look bad anyway right click on your clip insert velocity and you see this first marquee is this is what i do anyway just pull it up to 300 and then make two markers in between like that and then set these to 50 and then on this one where the beat's meant to be, but I just need to move it up a bit. So there. That's where the next beat is. Just pull it up. I try and make these as even as possible. And then the, this is basically all, all what flow is, it's not hard to do at all. You don't need to find it hard or anything, you just just keep doing this. This is all flow is. <laughs> Just adding points, moving them up. Adding points, moving them up. I think I've done this clip a bit too much. And if you can see, you can you can see it flowing already. Yeah. If you move it up, it's best. It's like it's good if you can get him doing the action. So you see him pulling away the clip there. If you can keep it up. To about there, where it's pulling clip and it's on 300, and then bang it back down to 50 so it'll look good, and it'll be slow motion when it's doing his knife, and then it'll speed back up onto something else if they can try, back onto his gun. And then it'll slow down on his. It just looks good when it's flowing. And it'll speed up when it's swapping to his wings. And then it should shoot around here. Oh. If he doesn't make it, just start messing with these to speed it up and stuff. Like so. And there we go. You want it where the fire explosion is, not when it comes up with hit marker, but where it shoots. So then you know it's actually properly synced. And then if you watch it, you can see that it's got flow on it. That's the ghosting effect on that by the way. So if you watch, it gets rid of it. Yeah, so that's that as well. Well, that might be a bit too much. There. And once again, you just that. 50. And just keep trimming it in until you get that. There. You can see synced. <laughs> and then you just keep doing that. That's all it really is. <laughs> and then wait. Uh, uh, yeah. and watch that. I don't know if that should have been on another beat. 
I don't know if we can mech it on an orb eater. No. I'll pull these down. Because they don't seem right on that beat, to be honest. Let's try that beat. Might not, I don't think it might be right because it's gun sound. It's got not got a gun sound in it yet. There we go. Maybe I might as well copy this. Um, I don't know if you already have these gun sounds, but if you don't, just go on. I think it's Quink. He has a tutorial for his gun sounds, and they're pretty nice. So yeah, just go and watch that one. There we go. Oh shoot. So yeah, that's basically just how you do it. That's just how you flow and sync clips. Like that. So all it basically is is just putting one before the marker and one after the marker and then one on the marker and just moving the marker up. That's all really flowing is. Right. See, that's all it really is. So yeah, that's my tutorial on how to flow and sync. Sorry if it's bad because it's my first ever tutorial so I don't really know what I was saying. <laughs> but yeah, if you want more tutorials on effects or anything, or on effects that you've seen in my videos, just tell me and I'll do them. Leave a like if you enjoyed or learned anything from this. Uh, subscribe if you want more. Or, yeah, if you enjoy my content, because it really does help me out. And uh, yeah, I will see you later. Peace.